cervical cancer, which has become a global health concern, has not spared Zambia, as the country has been faced with an increase in cervical cancer cases. In 2018, the country recorded 2,994 cases, with 1,839 dying of the disease in the same year. And in order to reduce these statistics, government has put measures in place through early screening and treatment. As a way of providing the service closer, Sinanga General Hospital in Western Province, which launched cervical cancer screening clinic in 2017, has called on more women to go for screening as a way of protecting their health. Then in May, we screened 135. Three were diagnosed and the same three were referred. Then in June, 40 were diagnosed one, 40 were screened, sorry, one was diagnosed and five were feared, meaning they were coming, but it's, it's good that they do the test so that they prevent it, they prevent themselves from getting the actual disease. Because if you have a, the actual disease cancer, it's very difficult to treat. Now, if we screen you early, we may just maybe remove the... the in providing early prevention in Senanga, the district health office has also provided human papilloma virus HPV vaccination targeting girls aged between 14 and 15. It comes to the HPV, um, for HPV, uh, which is human papilloma virus vaccine, um, we are giving this vaccine to protect our girls from cervical cancer. So our target group has been girls uh, of 14 years, that is for the first dose, and then um, the 15 year olds for the second dose. We, we managed to, to give for those one around uh, 748 girls um, and those two around 700 again, 704 or so. Beatrice Stahl is one of the women who has been going for screening frequently. <laughs> I do this on a regular basis. This is a way to protect myself. I am urging my fellow women not to shun away from cervical cancer screening as it will save our lives and it's not a painful process. Salome P reporting for Zanis in Tenanga, Western Province.